Panankam Namaskara Namaste. Hello and welcome to podcast, the podcast covering aspects of talk and everything associated with talks. I'm Sarvanan Jairaman, your host for the show. I love to spread the little knowledge which I have. I'll try to do the same here. This is episode two. In this podcast, I will talk about the most popular dog breeds. The American Kennel Club recognizes 190 breeds, whereas Federation Sinologic International recognizes around 360 dog breeds. As per some research, there could be more than 500 breeds across the world. Here, I'll be talking about some of the famous breeds which are favorite in India, and Indians love to have them as their pet. Uh, I would like to talk about these breeds one by one in no particular order. Labrador Retriever The Labrador Retriever, or the Lab as it is called fondly, is the most popular breed of dog not only in its originating country of Canada but also in India. It is also the most popular choice for assistance dogs in many countries. Many of labs work as guide dogs for the blind or as police dogs. The lab is very favorite among Indian police force as a dog breed. The breed originated in Newfoundland, where they were used to work with fishermen. The dogs helped pull the nets and caught fish that escaped from fishing lines. The breed has become an ideal family dog for many Indians. Labs typically love to swim and stay in water. That is called stepped paws. Many are athletic and energetic and love playing catch and retrieve games. They are normally cheerful, get along well with children and like other pets. They normally weigh between 25 and 34 kilograms. German Shepherd. The German Shepherd was originally developed for herding and guarding sheep. But his intelligence and extraordinary focus on any task at hand has made it a popular choice for police and military all over the world. German Shepherds are strong, smart, loyal and eager to please. This is a breed that excels at guarding. They are protected by their family and home and most of them are suspicious against strangers. Golden Retriever the Golden Retriever is one of the most popular breeds in the India and around the world. These dogs are intelligent, eager to please and hard workers. And combination that makes them perfect guide dogs, as well dogs as search and rescue dogs. They are generally good at whatever they do and take tasks seriously. These tasks are active and energetic and they require daily exercise. Golden Retriever have a joyful approach to life family that takes them hiking, jogging and lets them play every day. Dachshund. The Dachshund is a lively and friendly dog breed with German origin. The dogs were bred to be tough and fearless. Dachshunds are enthusiastic, playful and loving. They require moderate exercise and generally do well with children. This breed tends to get bored easily. So be prepared to keep your furry friend busy and load up with fun toys. A standard Dachshund weighs between 7 and 15 kilograms. Beagle. The Beagle is a sturdy hunting dog with cheerful personality. They are friendly, happy, enjoy the company of both humans and other dogs, and they make great family pets. They also have one of the best developed senses of, personal, uh, of smell of any dog. Beagle type dogs have existed for at least 2,000 years. They were popular in film, TV and comic books. This breed is very easy to care for. They don't drool, they don't smell like dog, and they shed little. The Beagles are generally healthy and an expected lifespan of 12 to 15 years. Beagles weigh between 9 and 11 kilograms. Cocker Spaniel. They are cheerful and generally get along well with children other dogs and other types of pets. The breed is sturdy, good-natured, clever and well-balanced. 
They usually get along well with children and pets of all kinds. Despite being so small, they possess both speed and endurance. These dogs are often described as a can-do dog that makes a great family companion. When it comes to grooming, this breed has an abundance of hair and they require regular grooming. On the bright side, brushing your dog is a great opportunity to warm. Cocker Spaniel weighs between 10 and 14 kilograms. Pug, the pug or the hutch dog. The pug in the hutch advertisement gave it a pet name as hutch dog. Uh, the pug is one of the oldest dog breeds and has flourished since at least 400 BC. The earliest mentions of the breed come from China, where the sturdy and cheerful little dog was a pet of the Buddhist monasteries in Tibet. There's a lot of dog in a small package. Pugs are even tempered, loving, charming, and often filled with mischief. They're curious and love to explore, but don't need excessive amounts of exercise. A pug can thrive almost anywhere, as long as they are close to the family. For a pug, the family is the sole reason for living. Pugs are generally happy. They are happy living in the country or in the city. Amongst children, or with the elderly, amongst other pets, or as an only dog. The average pug doesn't care where he or she lives as long as there is love. The short coat doesn't need a lot of grooming, but they shed a little. The wrinkles on the forehead and face must be kept clean and avoided. For all breeds with short snorts, the pug overheats quickly and can be prone to heat strokes. A pug generally weighs between 6 and 8 kilograms. Rottweiler. The dog breed is a robust breed who likes to have a job to do. The dogs are intelligent and self-confident and often used as sports dogs, service dogs, therapy dogs or even as herders. The breed is believed to stem back to ancient Rome and arrived to Europe with the Roman invading forces. When they reached Germany, the locals appreciated the dog's herding and guarding instincts and kept breeding them to enhance the skills. Rottweilers are believed to have Herded animals in Germany for at least 2,000 years. Until the industrial revolution was over and the dog services were no longer needed. The breed nearly fell extinct when a breed club was formed in the early 1900s and became extinct. Rottweilers love their family and are generally good natured and patient. They need a lot of excess but little grooming. Females generally weigh between 35 and 47 kilograms. Males weigh to more than 60 kilograms. Doberman. The Doberman comes from the town of Apolda, Germany, and the breed was first created in the late 18th century. The creator Carl Frederick Louis Doberman served as tax collector and he needed a companion that had to be strong, fast, loyal, and intelligent. To reach his goal, he bred many different kinds of dogs together, including the Björkren, Rottweiler, Greyhound, Great Dane, and the Weimar. The exact mix of dogs is unknown today. Dogs are known for their loyalty and intelligence and high trainability. They are considered walking dogs and many serve as police dogs and military dogs. The energetic, fearless, and obedient nature make them perfect for the job. They also make fantastic canine athletes. These dogs have a short coat and only need minimal grooming. They do need plenty of exercise. They are considered very active and need something to do to stay healthy and happy. Pomeranian. These dogs are generally playful with strong jumping ability and quick reflexes. They are quick to learn and eager to please, a combination that makes them excellent for duty and everyday jobs. These dogs get along well with children and they like to be close to the humans whenever possible. While not aggressive to visitors, they do announce newcomers loudly and have been used as watchdogs. The breed has a reputation of great empathy and are often used as comfort dogs. Dalmatian. The Dalmatian is the only spotted dog breed. Its two origins are real in mists of time. And these dogs have been credited with many nationalities and names. The spotted dog we know today has gotten its name from Dalmatia, a historical region of Italy. 
Russia close to the Atlantic Sea. But dogs of this type have appeared all over Europe, Asia and Africa. Many believe that the breed originated in India and there are dogs looking like Dalmatians on Egyptian tombs and in ancient ruins as old as 5000 years. Dalmatians have had many purposes through history. Some have been used for hunting, some as dogs of war or border guider, gardens, and others worked as shepherds. Many dogs can do these things, but Dalmatians are the unique breed. No other breed shared their talent for running with horses. These dogs are energetic and require daily exercise as well. They learn quickly and have excellent memories and excellent opinions, agility, and other dog sports. The endurance also makes them great search and rescue dogs. If you are considering a Dalmatian, remember the past as coach dogs. They require a lot of exercises, something to occupy them. Dalmatian puppies are born white and the first spots appear around three weeks after birth. After a month, they have most of their spots, but new ones can appear throughout life. Finnish Spits Finnish Spitz is an intelligent, lively and friendly dog from Finland that loves spending time with the family and being active. They get along well with other dogs and are known for loving children. This is a hunting breed originally created for hunting birds and small game. But they are often used for hunting moose and even bears. Being a barking hunting dog, they tend to bark at anything out of the ordinary. 160 times a minute. A Finnish Spitz is a generally healthy dog and they have an average lifespan of 18, oh sorry, 11 to 14 years. Females weigh between 8 and 10 kilograms and males between 11 and 13 kilograms. It's time to sign off for now. That's been the next episode.